Hello guys, welcome to how to fix tech. In this video guys, if your Wi-Fi icon is missing, you are not able to see the Wi-Fi option here. This video is for you. I will show you how to troubleshoot this issue in Windows 10 and 11 step by step. So let's start without wasting your time. So first we will use the Windows troubleshooter which comes by default on Windows 10 and 11 as 8. Open the control panel first. Once you open the control panel first, go to view by, select here the large icon. If you are getting this type of option, go to this, select here the large icons. Once you select here the large icons, go to troubleshooting this option. Click on this option, hardware and sound. Okay, once you go to this option, you need to look for this option network adapter click on that and click on next and it will try to resolve the issue related to the network adapter now you can choose the all adapter here click on next Now it is detecting the problems. It is taking longer time to resolve the issue. First it will detect the issue, then it will try to resolve the issue. But this is very powerful method to resolve the, this kind of issues is collecting results. Now troubleshooting could not identify the problem. So this is enabled to fix the problem. Close the troubleshooter. Go to back and go to network and internet. Okay, you will get the same kind of options here. Click on network connections and this time also try this troubleshooter. This is different from that. The network adopter is also listed here, but internet connection we also need to check. Now this has also unable to fix the problem. Let me close this. Go back to control panel. Now from here click on this option network and network and sharing center. Open this option. Once you open this option click on this option change change adapter settings. Click on that and you will get the windows like this. Now you can see the window sometime automatically disable the Wi-Fi. So we need to right click on the Wi-Fi, click on enable. And if it is already enabled here, you need to right click on that, disable it. Okay, disable it and then re-enable it. What this will do, does it, this will reset all the settings and refresh all the settings. Now click on this option. Now this is working fine, you can see here. I am able to connect the Wi-Fi connection here. If you are still getting the same issue, we can reset our network. Go to Windows Search by type our network reset. Like this. Click on network reset. Click on reset now. And click on yes button. And then you need to re-enter the password and thereafter restart your system. Once the reset is done, it will automatically prompt the restart. 
and once it is done restart it and your issue will be fixed so this is how you can troubleshoot this issue so hope your issue is fixed now if your issue is fixed then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix tech